Here's Brad Miller the shortstop. As he That's looks at a fastball that misses off the plate for ball one. That evens it up one and one. Oh, good action on the two seamer there and it's one and two. Yeah one pitch away now from getting through five shutout innings and I'll tell you what the way he's throwing this could turn out to be a night off for the bullpen. Set to deal on a ball and two strikes. Two and two now with two away and the base is empty. Just out in front of that one, still two and two. Ready on two balls and two strikes. Here it comes. Got him swinging, and that will end the inning. We'll see the dangerous Jose Bautista when we come back. It's the Blue Jays four, the Rays nothing. Xavier Cedeno is out now from the bullpen the now as he'll be making his Number first appearance of this young season. Jose Bautista will stand in again, but first we'll flash you back to the very first inning of the ballgame. And here you go, a solo home run that had him off and running early on. Drops in a strike to start the at bat. Nothing in one. Oh, that is a nice pitch right there. You kind of slow it down and give him that big breaking ball to start off the at bat. Make sure he's not a guy that's looking to ambush that first pitch fastball. On its way, the 0 1 pitch. That's taken. Now it's 0 2. Some would say he's showing good patience here, waiting for his pitch. But as a number five hitter, I think you need to make something happen. Swing and a miss, and the dangerous Bautista is set down on strikes for the first out. All right, guys, we're going to check this sequence out again on show track, but I can guarantee you he doesn't want to see it again. He's got this thing all backwards up there. He looks at the first two pitches. Those are pitches he probably should have swung at. Then he swings at the one pitch that's out of the strike zone. In now, Chris Colabello. Yeah. He'll wait out a breaking pitch here that oh, finds the zone for strike one. Bases are empty, one man out. Swing, line, drive. That's going to be trouble. Around first, heading for second now. And he'll cruise into the bag at second with a one-out double. You know, sometimes Down people back. talk about no well, doubters hey, when a guy hits one 20 Down rows back. into the Brown. seats. Well, that's a no-doubt double right there. No chance for any of these outfielders to get it. With their backs to the infield, they got to get back there, get the ball back into the infield just to save a double. Here's the left-handed hitting Dominic Brown. And she'll take a tough pitch on the outside part of the plate for strike one. Tough spot here for a left-handed hitter facing a guy that's exceptionally tough on lefties. Yeah, you generally get so many at-bats against right-handed pitching. Now you're in a good RBI spot, and you're stuck facing a guy like this. The 0-1 pitch. Check swing, but he held up in time, ball one. You know, sometimes when you're thinking fastball, you try to get moving just a little bit early. And that's a good job of recognizing off speed and then holding back on the swing. Swing, 
swing and a miss as he pulled the string on him one and two. Oh, and I like that he went right back to that curveball there after the check swing. Yeah, you almost got him once. Try it again and see if he can hold off twice. Chop this one right side. And he'll take this one to the bag for the out. But meanwhile, the runner will move up 90 feet to third base. Yeah, he didn't do a whole lot with this swing right there. But at the very least, he does move that runner up 90 feet now with two away. Russell Martin stands into the box. He's 0 for 2 so far in this one. Here's the first pitch to him. And he starts the number eight hitter with a strike. Nothing in one. And you can see him trying to be a little bit more patient here. He's got two strikeouts already. But he's got to be careful not to fall too far behind. A one count. Here's the pitch. And there's a swing and a miss by Martin as he falls behind now. 0 and 2. Yeah. When that's upstairs like that. That's a pitch you got to leave alone and make him bring something down. Protecting on 0 and 2 so we'll do it again. Ready with the 0 2. And this ball's pretty well struck high and deep to left field. And this had home run distance, but it just does hook foul. Two outs here with a runner at third. Swing and a miss, and that ends the inning. Blue Jays held in check, but they hold a four to nothing lead. Kevin Kiermeyer. We'll come in now to start things out here in their half of the sixth as they look for a reversal of fortunes here. The first five innings have not been particularly kind to them. Yeah, and I think that's putting it mildly. Just one hit in these first five innings. They're going to need to do a better job of finding good pitches to hit. But that fellow on the mound has not made it easy on him, and that's for sure. Yanked into the stand, strike one. Now some definite signs of life in that Toronto bullpen. Both a lefty and a right-hander begin to throw. Stroman steps into the windup, coming at him with the 0-1. Hit out towards second. Travis fields it cleanly. A quick out, out number one. Yeah, two no pitches, one out. Second and that's how you want to start an inning when you're Logan. already over 90 Outside. pitches for the ball game. Logan Forsythe will try it again. 0 for 2 with a fly out and a ground ball thus far. Well, guys, if you split the difference between the fly ball and the grounder he's put in play, you've got a nice line drive. So maybe we'll witness that right here. Chop foul at the plate, strike one. Now a swing and a miss, and things are not looking real promising here. Down 0-2. Well, that pitch isn't going to light up the radar gun, but it's been effective. Well, it doesn't have to. If you get that good movement and put it in the right spot, it's plenty good enough to do the job. Pitch swung on and hit in the air toward the line in right. On the move is Batista. He hauls it in without any trouble, and there are two away. And a lot of times, you, know, you might say, ah, you know, four-run lead, we'll make that up. But I tell you, the way he's throwing the ball right now, they might be fortunate just to get one run off him. Corey Dickerson will stand in, and he, like so many others, hitless in the ballgame so far. Well, we've been talking about it a lot, but this offense is just getting shut down right now. And we've seen some really fantastic pitching in this one. Hit hard down the left field line. But this is going to get foul. Bases are empty here with two men out. Uh, 
Fastball, and he's quickly in the hole, 0-2. And that has been the comfort zone so far in this outing. He's just lived on that outside corner, and it's paid big dividends for him. This is hit out to right. Does he have another 1-2-3 inning? He does. Seven in a row he's set down now as the side is retired. Down in order go the Rays. They're on the short end of a 4-0 score. Back here at Tropicana Field in St. Pete. Seventh inning coming up with the Jays out in front as we give you a look at our game summary to this point. Devin Travis is set.